Now, here's meteorologist Pete Mangione with your live Pinpoint Doppler 12 Futurecast. Happy Mother's Day. We will be seeing some showers today in terms of planning it out by meal. Well, I'd say an early breakfast is okay. That avoids the rain. A dinner is fine. A late afternoon barbecue is fine. It's lunchtime where most of these showers will be coming on through. And on live pinpoint Doppler 12, notice a lot going on. So let's break this down. We have this rainy green appearance. Some of this is just clutter, but it's also representing some of the uh, mist drizzle, the fog that we have out there. A lot of moisture in the low levels of the atmosphere. The steadier rain is just off to our west. As I widen out the view, you can see the yellows and the darker greens representing where these showers are coming from. And we can actually uh, time these out and give you an approximation for uh, exactly when they're expected to arrive. So basically, these will be tracking from west to east, and I'd say they move through the uh, Providence area around 10.30 in the morning. For westerly, maybe a bit earlier, just before 10 in the morning, and then we will get rid of these by the time we get to the late afternoon. So it's just a situation where we have to be patient to wait for the sunshine and the end of the rain. In the meantime, we're looking at a future cast which shows, as I just mentioned, the rain coming down at lunchtime. This is noon. Time, a few of these showers could be briefly heavy, represented by the yellow. By 2 o'clock in the afternoon, still some showers around, especially from New Bedford out towards the Cape Cod Canal. By 3 p.m., this is what we call a mixed bag, where we have everything going on. Sunshine, a few isolated sprinkles. At this point, yes, you can try to venture outside, do something fun with mom, but the app, the pinpoint weather app, a good thing to have with you at this point because there's still maybe a few areas picking up an isolated shower. And then by 5 p.m., we're talking sunshine and a decent amount of wind. We'll talk about the wind part of the future cast in just a few minutes. This is overnight through Monday morning. Partly cloudy skies, but notice what's happening. Not seeing any rain, and that really sets the trend as we go into the week. 48 your temperature right now in Smithfield. 51 in Providence. 49 Newport. 45 on Block Island. With winds relatively light. They're coming in from the south right now, but they will shift from the west late morning into the afternoon behind that front. Here's the fog I was talking about. We have a lot of it from Newport into Narragansett. You could see uh, a few cars out. I've also seen a few uh, people walking along the seawall. Visibility not quite as bad. In fact, it's fine right now in Providence. Yesterday morning, actually, it was tough to make out these wind turbines in the background, but this morning, no problem seeing that. And a higher up view from Providence shows the mostly cloudy skies, but good visibility. So it really just depends on where you are for seeing that fog this morning. Low category for the threat tracker today, tomorrow, on into Wednesday. We're not expecting any of these showers to turn severe. Of course, we'll keep you updated online should that change. But I think in terms of the heavier showers, those states who are north and west, for the most part, as we'll get more of the light to moderate rain variety as these pass on through. Widening out the view, you can see what's happening here. Behind this, not a whole lot going on. This will be our cleaning mechanism today. This will really shove out a lot of the junk in the atmosphere that's been affecting our weather, giving us that bad weather uh, the past couple days, not allowing a lot of sunshine. So this is sort of our change-up pitch, really uh, shifting around our weather pattern, which most of us do want to see. This also sums up the chance of rain pretty well today. Notice this big uh, uh, bar graph lift here, noontime into 2 p.m., and then it really drops rapidly by the late afternoon. So in the seven day future cast, I just wanted to point one thing out. I mentioned how I was going to talk about the wind. So why not deliver on that promise right now? Showers through the morning and afternoon, 4 p.m., some sunshine, windy. Could see some wind gusts between 30, 35 miles an hour. Something to keep in mind if you're outside with mom during the late afternoon or the evening. Should be a pretty nice sunset. And then tomorrow, 68 degrees. It's a cool start, a bit of a breeze. So you're going to wake up tomorrow morning and think, okay, where's the mild weather, Pete? Well, it's coming. It just takes until the afternoon to get here. And then it sticks around through much of the work week. You can see around 69 on Wednesday, low 70s on Thursday, and then a little cooler on Friday and Saturday with some showers moving in. But we'll take it. We'll take this weather pattern for sure. If you want to read more about this upcoming work week in terms of the weather, you can always find that at WPRI.com.